everyone, Mango7 Roll here. How are we doing today? Welcome to another episode of Epic 7. And today we are going to kind of revisit Vildred a little bit. And the reason why we're going to revisit Vildred a little bit is because of this person here um, calling me out for showing my ignorance on the build. The dude's damage scales with speed. Why the hell would you want not want him to be fast? Uh, and I want to kind of clarify that since it might not be obvious for people that do read stuff like that, you know, that that do look at the skills um, and don't really understand why you might want to go uh, one stat over another. Especially when if we look in game here, let's go take a look at Vildred. I'm sure I'm not going to be able to find him. You'd think he'd be in the important parts here. Nope. Oh, yay. First try. So you'd think here damage dealt increases proportionate to the caster's speed. Uh, you would you would think you would think that speed would be the best way to get his damage up, but it just simply is not the case. Um, so the best way to figure this out, if you're trying to understand whether you want attack percent or speed boots, for example, is uh, use a damage calculator. It's really simple to do. Like somebody uh, that knows the stats in and out can probably figure this out without this. But if you're trying to learn, this is the best way to do it. And again, we have this in the description below, math.github.io. Um, I will link it there. So let's go take a look at Vildred. I haven't actually seen the difference here. I'm just assuming I'm right. So I hope I'm right, you know. I would look pretty dumb if I was wrong. Um, so let's actually go take a look. Uh, let's... Let's go back to our Vildred and just give him a set of gear like we did before. Um, Because ba -ba -ba. my reasoning for Vildred is you really want to one-shot things with Vildred uh, because you want your skill 3 proc and you just want to get a lot of stuff done like that. Um, so you don't need to be any faster than 130, 140 if all you're using Vildred for is farming. And even if you're using him for farming primarily, but also as a Manicus or Banshee or something like that, he doesn't need to be fast there either. Uh, so this is my build on my Vildred. We've got 42, 47 attack and 129 speed. So we will remember that. So let's go to 42, 47 attack. God, I forgot. He he put this in. 42, 47. He put that in just for me. Um, critical damage. We are at 258. 248, sorry. Oh, almost perfect. Uh, we are also at 129 speed. So let's put that there. Okay, and now with um, our damage here, we've got our stats in. Our skill one critical hit is doing 5,000, and we're pretty much only ever using skill one. Like, we're never using um, skill three, especially on auto, because we really just want to make it uh, not have to look through that animations. You can go through skill three if you want, but look at the damage difference 5250 versus 49, 4086. Not too much. If you give him some Molagoras too, damage obviously increases there. But now let's take a look in the game again. And remember we did 5k damage. Um, so let's go back to our Vildred. Uh, Vildred, Vildred. Oh, God. Why is this always so hard? <laughs> give me a search. I know he's got decency. There we go. Uh, so we're going to go to Vildred and we're going to go to manage equipment and we're going to change his boot or his attack boots. To speed. We're going to have to change things a little bit because I do not have an attack set pair of speed boots. Um, so we're going to have to give him a crit set speed boots and we will give him this. Uh, which one has more attack? This one has um, this one has more attack and that's all we're really caring about. And that means we need another attack set somewhere. So... Let's use an attack set chest here. I think this chest is actually better. Um, so this should stem out to more damage anyway. So now he's sitting at 3,500 attack. Uh, 3,500 attack here. So let's change that really quickly. 3,500 attack. Oh, you can't even see that. LOLOL. Trust me, I'm, I'm, I'm editing it in right. I am. I'm a. I'm in. I'm a content creator. I know how to do this. Um, there, there. That's close enough. So, 3,500 there, 248 there. And we are now at um, 165 speed. Okay, so 165 speed. Uh, 3,500 attack. The same crit damage and arguably better gear. I, I think this is better gear than what we had on. 
Now his skill one is only doing 4211. So we are essentially losing 800 damage on his skill one, um, depending on the defense of the target, which is not good because that's the difference between getting a kill and not. So let's go to extremes here. Let's make him um, 230 attack or 230 speed here. So we're up to 230 speed and he's still only doing 4393 damage here. So let's go like down to 220. So 4393, we gain like 10 damage for every, every 10 speed. So what I'm trying to get at is there is a huge difference depending on what stuff scales by on their multiplier. Because sometimes when stuff scales by speed, it's generally not really scaling by much. So it's a little bit of a bonus, but everything scales with attack, I think. Everything scales with attack, and it always scales with attack more the vast majority of the time. So even if you are rocket speed, 350 speed, you're not going to be doing more damage than just an attack Vildred with attack, you know? Um, obviously, you'll be going 50,000 more times, and there's no way you would take the attack build over 350. Speed, but just in pure terms of pure raw damage where all you need to do is get that initial kill the attack is definitely definitely so this is something everybody should take advantage of if you're sitting there on free equipment removal trying to figure out which piece of gear to go with you need to consort or consult this little bit of information you need to consult stuff like this and really take advantage of it over just guessing, you know, like it makes such a difference in the long run, trying to decide on how much damage to do. Um, specifically with attack and crit damage, it's less important with something like speed because speed, you kind of usually just want to go as fast as possible and you're not worrying about the damage side of things. You're worried about the speed. Um, but yeah, that's all I wanted to show today. I just wanted to make it clear that I at least do know what I'm talking about. And <laughs> um, despite what some YouTube comments say, uh, I do understand things and it does make sense to me and uh i am not wrong every single time so yeah that's it thank you so much for watching if this helped you out feel free to like comment subscribe as always and i will talk to y'all later have a wonderful day bye everybody